Ladies, gentlemen, pronouns, lend me your ears. Crazy Kid back for another react. We're going back to country with Toby Keith and How Do You Like Me Now. <clears throat> now, this song here is going back quite a ways uh, in his early uh, part of his career. And this was one of the songs that really gained his popularity and really gained a lot of respect within the community of country music artists. Uh, so without any further ado, let's get into Toby Keith and How Do You Like Me Now? Baby, I've waited 20 years to show you my true feelings. Meet me at the center field stands, midnight. As you can see by the video, it's about a high school or college kid that was uh, trying to hook up with uh, the head cheerleader, and she just kind of brushed him off and kind of laughed at him and stuff like that. And now that he's achieved a success level, he's all of a sudden, you know, the shoe's on the other foot. She's wanting to meet, you know, who this secret admirer is. And meanwhile, it was the guy that she made fun of earlier in life. And in retaliation, he immediately just put her phone number in, <laughs> called for a good time on the middle of the uh, football field. But, <clears throat> you know, all practical jokes aside, you know, success is probably one of the best ways to show your opposition, hey, what you think of me doesn't bother you. What you think I can do, I'll prove it wrong. Success is the best motivator to become successful. When I took off to Tennessee, I heard that you made fun of me. Never imagined I'd make it this far. Then you married in the money, girl, ain't it a cruel and funny world? He took your dreams and he tore them apart He never comes home and you're always alone And your kids hear you cry down the hall Alarm clock starts ringing, who could that be singing? It's me, baby, would you wake up call? How do you like me now? How do you like me now? Now that I'm on my way you still think I'm crazy standing here today I couldn't make you love me but I always dreamed about living in your radio How do you like me now? Yeah. Now like I said before, you know, success is the best way to get back at the people who are treating you in a negative light. 
show them that not only what they're saying doesn't bother you, doesn't affect you, it actually motivates you. Just like anything else in this world, use success to motivate you to overcome the negativity. Um, and it's uncanny the way that the two main or two lead women, like the cheerleader and the woman that he's lured here uh, to basically show her that, you know, hey, now I'm successful. How do you like me now? How those two women actually look like they could be, you know, the same woman from years apart. And the same thing with the person that they found to play Toby Keith's younger version. How similar that, you know, they could be, you know, like, hey. This is, uh, it, it was very, it's very interesting the way that they found these people to play these particular parts. Final thoughts, final thoughts. That look at the end with those two women looking at each other like, oh, missed the boat on that one, didn't we? Just shows that you just never know who you may be dealing with at the time. They may end up achieving a success level that you would never expect. So the way I always look at it is treat people with respect dignity and kindness and people like Mr. Toby Keith who is no longer with us anymore uh, passed away earlier here in uh, 2024 uh, he was from what I've heard he was one of the nicest people you could ever meet so you know let's have a comment uh, or a discussion in the comment section uh, about have you ever met Toby Keith? Have you ever achieved a success when somebody's ever, you know, said that you couldn't or, you know, basically shunned you in any way? Um, have you ever used success as a way to, you know, basically show your opposition up to say, hey, you said I couldn't do it. I did it. It's mine. I achieved this. Uh, let's have a discussion about that. If you've ever met Toby Keith, you know, uh, let's hear about your stories with him. Um, like I said, uh, you know, from videos I've watched, uh, you know, interviews and stuff like that, I've heard that he's one of he was one of the nicest people you could have ever possibly hoped to meet. Um, and uh, you know, a, a link to the original source video will be in the description box, and I encourage you to go and you know give that uh, video a view, a like, um, you know, throw a comment. Um, and, you know, subscribe to the channel if possible. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe here, folks. Uh, share this out. The more we share it out, the better we get, the better, the more uh, success we get. So until we get to the next one, folks, I wish everybody peace, love, and happiness.